But now we've got to get, to, and I don't want to commit. I say, I'm going to rewrite your poverty program. You, all, you boys got together and wrote this stuff, and I thought we were just going to have NYA. As I understood it, you know what I think about the poverty program, what I thought we were going to do? Well, I thought we were going to have CCC camps. We got that. And I thought we were going to have a community action where a city or a county or a school district or some governmental agency could sponsor a project, state highway department sponsored, and we'd pay the labor and, uh, and a very limited amount of materials on it. But to uh, make them put up most of the materials and a good deal of supervision and so forth, they'd like to get that. Uh, I thought that we'd say to a high school boy that's about to drop out, we'll let you work in the library, sweep the floors, or work in the shrubs, or, or pick the rocks, and we'll pay you enough so you can stay in school. We got that. I thought you'd let a college boy do the same thing. We got a college girl. Now, I never heard of any liberal outfits that's where you could subsidize anybody. I think I'm against that. I just, uh, you all doing the Peace Corps, then that's your private thing, and it's Kennedy. But my my Johnson program, I'm against subsidizing any private organization. Now, if we had $100 billion, we might need to. But with all the governmental agencies in this country, I'd a whole lot rather Dick Daly do it than the Urban League. And he's got the heads of departments, and he's got experienced people that are handling hundreds of millions of dollars. And every one of these places, I'd make them come in and sponsor these projects. And I just think it makes us wide open, and I don't want anybody to get any grants.